Hi, in this video we are going to um, create some screen captures and save them as PDF files. It's very useful when you want to capture some of the pro um, process of what you do on the web or something or your programs input and output and this is how to use this video. Um, let's say I have a program here in my C drive tem HTML CSS example 003 selector and if I double click on it this is the output I like this output I want to do a screen capture of it I also like the validation of this markup validator so I like the validation result here I want to make a screen capture of this because when I validate the file it works okay it works very well I like this page okay and I want to if I want to do another screen capture of let's say CSS validation I validate this file it works as well okay it very good so I like this screen captures and um, I'm going to I'm going to do screen captures of this that and that okay and I'm going to save this in a word document word document so I'm going to create a new document called Microsoft Word I'm going to call it assignment open it up okay I'm going to do the screen one here screen two Okay, screen three is here. Save the file. So let us do our first screen capture here. I like this and I want it to be smaller. I can actually make it smaller. So I'm going to press my print screen on your keyboard. Press your print screen. And then I'm going to need a graphic editing software I'm going to just use paint Microsoft paint everybody should have that if you're running Windows and I'm going to do a control V to paste okay and I like this part of the page so I'm going to use select to select everything and I'm going to do a control C is to copy on control X is cut cut is actually better um, because I can actually I can actually um, cut out the whole thing so let's do a control X which is cut okay so I'm going to do a control X cut come back here Control V to paste. Okay, save your work. And then I need another piece, screen capture two. So I shift over here and I can even make it smaller by pressing the control mouse wheel. Okay or bigger so I like this page I say print screen on your keyboard come to paint do a paste again control V to paste okay and I, I like this part right So I do my select. If it's too big, you can actually zoom out. Okay. So I like this part. So I would just let's 
so like this part. Control X to cut. Come back to your word. Control V to paste. The last one, screen capture three, is this page. Okay, green screen. Go over here. Control V to paste. You like this part, so I can zoom out. I like this piece, so go back to home, select. Control X to cut. Control V to paste. So you're done. So it has three pages. But it's a Word document, it's not a HTML file. So let me, you can even resize it nicely. You know, you can make it slightly smaller. Make sure you press the Shift key when you resize. So when you press shift key, they actually maintain the aspect ratio. So let's resize this guy if you want. Okay, screen capture one, two, and three. Okay, and but this is a Word document, so you have to it's not very useful, it's not. It's a word, when people look at it, the format is messed up and things like that, so you can save it as a PDF, so you can do a file, save as, C drive again, change the type to PDF, do a save, so now you have a PDF document, okay, it will look the same on all, um, all computers, operating system so on and so forth so save this so now in your C temp you have a PDF file so you can submit this for your assignment you can send it to your friend and so on and so forth so that's all for today thank you very much for watching